What's the point? Anyway, I have no money. You're also not going. I have to help with the service here first. What about you? I can't. That boy, Alex. It's not only that he's sick or that he has no money. He's very quite depressed. I see what I can do. By the way, your patient is doing very well. I thank you. that burned the martyrs of Uganda will never go out. They are fires of hope. The martyrs faced death, yet they are alive today in glory. So we, like them, can put our hope in God. Ah, you are following the broadcast of the celebrations from the shrine. Would you like to know more about some of the matters? Are you free tomorrow? Many years ago, missionaries came to this country to bring us the good news of Jesus Christ. For seven months, they walked from the coast of the Indian Ocean to the shores of Lake Victoria. And two of them embarked in a small canoe. After spending 27 days on this lake, Father Ludell and Brother Amans landed here. country. We ask you to bless it and bless our mission. Amen. Mwebani, he says, who are you? Mwebudewa, where do you come from? Do you have the permission from the king to come to our land? What brings you here? I am a white father. I have come here to learn from you and to tell you about Jesus who told us to call God our Father. Proceed to the King's Palace. I will give you guides to lead you to the tree. You might wait for me to come and introduce you to the king.
is this man Jesus you always talk about? Jesus is the son of God. God loved us so much that he sent his own son to us to teach us about himself. Jesus told us to call God our father. We believe that the only way to God is through his son Jesus. Yes, but how did you get to know about this man Jesus? Father Ludell faced a lot of difficulties over the first few years in establishing the Catholic Church in the area. He faced opposition from other religions and also from key people in the King's Court. But he was a man of great faith. And the manner in which he dealt with these difficulties impressed the people. They began to come to him to learn about the that faith. That he loves us and how much he loves us. One of those who came was Mathias Mlumba, a local chief in the area of Mityana. His children, members of his family. That's why we have to thank God. You call God in your language Katonda, the one who has created everything. Two others were Joseph Mukasa Balikudembe and Andrew Kagwa. Balikudembe was a man privy to all the palace decisions. He was noted for his skill and prowess at sport and games. Kagwa was a royal page and was master drummer at court. He was an exceedingly kind man and was a friend of persons of every class. <coughs> The White Fathers had brought some medicines and began treating the sick who came to them. You are a very kind person, Father. You've cared for our people so much. We thank you. But why do you do this, Father? I follow Jesus. He is my master. He taught us to love everybody, even our enemies. How do I become like Jesus? Oh, you have to learn for many years, and then you will be baptized, and you will become a special friend of Jesus. You will be one of his people. Will you teach us, Father? Yes, we can begin right now. I will teach you the prayer Jesus taught his friends. Our Father, who art in heaven, you repeat that. Our, Our Father, who art in heaven. heaven, hallowed be thy name. <laughs> Mulumba began to instruct the people in his area in the Christian faith. Jesus said that no matter what problem you face, no matter what situation you're in, he will always be there for you. That is all for today. Thank you for coming. We will meet another day. He continued to grow in his relationship with Jesus. 
He also helped Balikudembe and Kagwa in their growth in faith. The Lord is good. He makes it possible for me to continue coming here to learn about him and to do my duties as well. The king has made me his personal attendant. That means I have to be at his beck and call. However, I've decided to continue learning, no matter how long it might take me. Well, I've been promoted to chief bandmaster. Mm. But I wouldn't stop coming here for anything. I've learned to be patient. God's ways are not ours. This is why we should have faith in him. Matia, how about you? I was told by my father, by adoption, that we did it not the truth. But, he said, that men will come to show us the right way. And since then, I have been in search of the truth. And now, I know that I've found the truth. Hey, this one here. It's my ghost. Oh, it's your ghost. As he approached his baptism, <laughs> 